UAE is such a melting pot of cultures, right? You have people from all over the world coming down and settling here. You have a lot of people, especially coming in from India as well. There are also a lot of associations from India, and one such association is the Uttarakhand Association. Now, these people have more than 2,000 members, and they've done a lot of work to help the underprivileged. Recently, they had a celebration, and here's a look at what the Uttarakhand Association is all about. <laughs> <laughs> Uttarakhand, a state in the northern part of India known as the land of gods and the land of natural beauty. Archaeological evidence supports that there has been human existence in the region since prehistoric times. Therefore, it has a rich culture and heritage. Over the years, the people of Uttarakhand have moved all around the world for better prospects. The 2,000-member strong Uttarakhand Association in the UAE has made constant efforts to keep their traditions alive and pass the same to the coming generations. अपने आजीविका के लिए अपने कारोबार के लिए अपने व्यवसाय के लिए दूर-दूर रहते हैं उनमें भी इस कल्चर को समावेश करना मैं समझता हूं कि एक बहुत बड़ी उपलब्धि है पिछले 4 सालों में हमने काफी तरक्की करी है और काफी लोग हमारे साथ जुड़े हैं और सभी अपनी फील्ड में बहुत अच्छा काम कर रहे हैं और उसके साथ-साथ अपनी संस्कृति और सभ्यता को जीवित रखने के लिए एक छोटा सा प्रयास यहां पर कर रहे हैं Local talent from Uttarakhand, Kritika Rawat, was felicitated for her work in the radio industry for the past 10 years. She was handed a memento of appreciation by the Health Minister of Uttarakhand, Surendra Singh Negi. Kritika Rawat ji ne ek main samajhta hu misal paida ki hai ki itne dur rehte hue bhi apne Uttarakhand ka naam roshan kiya hai aur iske piche swabhavik rup se unka dedication hoga, nishtha hogi. This gesture to Kritika Rawat has made all the people of Uttarakhand and Dubai proud. I'm really, really happy to get this award. Um, any sort of recognition for you know your work is just makes you feel really good. Appreciation is always a great thing, especially from my own community, the Uttarakhand Association. I think they're doing some fabulous work. And uh, I'm proud to be from Uttarakhand. I've always said I'm Kritika Rawat, and that's who I am, and that's who I'm going to be. Performances by folk artists mark the evening by bringing all colors of Uttarakhand down to the UAE. The Meridian Al Aqa Beach Resort Fujairah recently hosted the seventh edition of the esteemed Lifeguard Championships. Not even the thunder, lightning and heavy rains could dampen the spirits of the 20 teams from hotels and resorts around the UAE. They competed in seven individual and team events aimed at showcasing their life-saving skills. It's an event that's got a very serious message to it, but presented in a nice way. We're trying to bring awareness to all the people who use swimming pools and beaches about the seriousness of lifeguarding and the skills that all these boys and girls need to have um, in order to make sure the, uh, the, the beaches and pools are safe for everybody to use. And at the same time, because these boys and girls are so fit and trained so much, it's great to make them compete against each other and you know, for them to prove who's the strongest and best one around. It was a test of skills, physical fitness and stamina. A balance of water and on-sand activities, pushing them beyond all limits with each and every team giving their best performance. Not only was this a great success, full of cheering and support, but also a great opportunity to raise public awareness about the importance of lifeguards and the significance of their role. It's the first time we are sponsoring the Lifeguard Championships. Uh, basically, uh, when we got this opportunity, we were really pleased to associate with an event uh, that promotes safety in the waters. So, uh, Arena being a brand uh, that 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 uh, positions itself as a brand uh, to be present wherever there's water. So, you know, uh, with an event uh, which has a CSR angle to it, I think uh, you know this was the perfect opportunity for Sun and Sand Sports, uh, which is the region's biggest uh, retailer and wholesaler in this region, to be associated with the brand. 
event like Arena and the championships, yes. Well, the competition started quite small. We started with about 12 teams. Um, today, seven years on, it, there is now 20 teams, which are covering most of the Emirates. We have teams from Abu Dhabi, teams from Dubai, teams from Ras Al Khaimah, um, and the teams from Fajera. So, all, most of the five, top five star resort hotels are involved. Um, they, they find this a, a, a extremely competitive um, place and they want to show who's the best, of course. After a long and tiring day, the evening progressed with even more excitement as all the teams eagerly awaited the medal ceremony. By the end of the day's events, the team from Le Meridian, Mina Siahi, had taken first place. Their efforts were awarded with round-trip economy tickets from Emirates Airlines to any destination in the GCC, India, Sri Lanka or the Philippines. I think uh, we're looking for this uh, trophy since last four years. I think this is our second time we won this event. Last three months, these kids came 6 o'clock in the morning and up to 9 o'clock and two sessions. I think they done a hard job at the end of the day and all credit to go to the, the team members. Okay, sorry, but I'm not sure if you're going to be a good one. I'm not sure if you're going to be a good one. program am not sure if you're going to be a good one. I'm not sure if you're going to be a good one. But that's happening after the break.